vital parts fall from his system and dissolve in Scottish rain. Like, subscribe, but importantly, watch the video all the way through. And if you fancy, you can also buy me a coffee as well. The link's down in the description. Abbey and Kudis is just down there at the water. This was uh, founded back in the 1200s and it's now part, well it's now basically ruinous, but the main tower still exists and that's part of the church, which is still used today. So we'll back down. As I said before, this is Kudis Abbey. Uh, we're at Kudis. Uh, surprise in the name, actually. Um, this might be a bit familiar to those that have seen Outlander. Uh, certainly, if you've been on one of my tours, we've probably stopped off here um, if we were doing the Central Highlands tour. It's a really short little drive out of Edinburgh. Now, this is a port town, a uh, port village, and it was one of the busiest ports in all of Scotland um, in the 1600s. <laughs> As I said before, this is um, one of the filming locations of Outlander. So if you're a big fan of that, then hopefully you might enjoy this. Now it's Cransmuir in Outlander. Now, it might look a little bit different because everything's all painted white. When they filmed it, they went in and painted everything kind of a dark grey colour. And then once they were finished with filming, they would then go back and paint it all white again. What's that? <laughs> 